Hello and welcome to the Change Gang Podcast with me, your host, Laura Ordeal. I'm here to help you hold on to your sanity and your soul as you move through big change. I'm here to guide you from frustration to flow in your life, bridging the practical and the woo just for you. Let's go. Welcome to the week, Change Gang. I hope that it's going well for you and that you have set some intentions for the week to bring about something in your life that you want to change because that is key in driving and maneuvering your own life and making the change possible that you want for yourself. Oftentimes we're just responding to what life is throwing at us and saying, oh, things are never changing. Things don't change. They're changing all the time. It's just a matter of whether you're directing that change in the way that you want it to go. And today I want to tell you about a new series that I'm putting together. It will still be posted under the Change Gang podcast, but it will be posted on a new day and it will be labeled as, uh, I believe, probably a trauma series. And some people might say, well... I don't have trauma or that's not for me, but I want you to just take a moment and listen to a few of them anyway. Do that as a favor to me because I think you'll find that oftentimes we have things in our life that are not necessarily what we think they are. And I say that because, yes, I'm calling it a trauma series because of a new way that I'm working with people. And because when I started and stepped into doing hypnotherapy and NLP and working with that, I very much had in mind helping people with trauma, with PTSD, with those things that I know can be so debilitating in life. What I didn't know at the time was all of the things that are related to things that have happened to us in our life that do not get put under the trauma umbrella, but they often are related. And because our world lives in labels and diagnoses and, and, and all of these things, because we somehow think we need it to fit into something in order to say, oh, okay, I, I have ADHD, so now that explains all of these other things in my life. Or I have PTSD, so now I know why I'm depressed, why I have IBS, why I can't sleep. Now I know. It doesn't matter. If you have all of those things, you're going to want them fixed anyway. And oftentimes it might just be one symptom that you're having. And so you don't relate it to quote-unquote trauma. However, the work that I'm doing and the work that I'm sharing about that so many other people are doing are clearing these symptoms. They're clearing depression. It's clearing anger and shame and guilt and all of the things behind anger. It's clearing tinnitus, IBS, weight issues. I don't even have the list in front of me to go through and tell you all of the crazy amazing things that it is getting rid of in people's life. All of the symptoms that are there. It's incredible. It's absolutely incredible. And if you're thinking, well, I have I have Crohn's disease. I was diagnosed with Crohn's disease. The medical people said this is a physical thing. I get it. I get it. Or maybe you were diagnosed with migraines or some other form of headache. I get it. That's what they say, yes, this is what's happening in your life. However, there may be a way to go in and hit the reset button to clear that medical condition, that experience that you're having in the physical by doing it at a different level, by doing it in the realm of hypnosis. Going in at that level And changing things with the unconscious, the subconscious, where everything is being run, your whole body is being run by the subconscious. So you can go in and change and reset 
things in your body that people would say are physical at that mind level, mental level, whatever you want to call it. It can be done. I'm watching it be done constantly. I was just speaking with someone who's going to be a part of that new series that I'm doing who has told me that she has had 100%, 100% success rate in clearing away the symptoms of the people that she's working with. How would that feel to get rid of the migraines, to get rid of the IBS, to sleep comfortably through a night, to not have the panic attacks any longer or the anxiety? How would that feel? I know how it feels. I know because I've cleared myself. I've had migraines in my life. I've had anxiety. I've had panic attacks. I've had digestive issues. None of it, none of it is any fun. And yes, a lot of them I was medicated for. I was diagnosed for. I had all of the things. I had COVID long haul with what they would say is chronic fatigue. And my doctor was nervous and afraid to even say, don't, you know, he told me don't panic, but I want you to start looking into this as he spoke to me about chronic fatigue when I had long call. And things can and do change. People who have tinnitus and are told it's a hearing issue. Hearing is translated and happens inside the brain. And things can be reset in the brain quite often, more times than not. And I feel sometimes like I'm selling a miracle cure or I'm saying that, it, you know, something that's too good to be true. However, the information is there. I can probably go pull up about 28,000 studies of how hypnosis helps, how hypnosis works with all of these things and more. And more. I mean, I don't even have the list in front of me of all the things that it can help with. So even though I talk about it being trauma or PTSD or or something like that, and you might think, oh, that's not me. I get it. But listen to what's behind that. Listen to the words of what I'm talking about helping with. And if you're not sure I don't mention something that you're dealing with, reach out to me and say, has there been success with helping with this, because that's your issue. And if I haven't treated it, I will reach out and find out in the myriad of people that I I have in my groups to say, have you had success with this? And either that will mean, yes, I can absolutely help you, or I will have that person who is has the expertise that you can reach out to. But I know it's making a difference. I know it's allowing people to step into a life that is different than the one they're living right now with the symptoms they're having right now. And in as little as six weeks, as little as six weeks, sometimes left, those things can be gone. It's happening left and right and center all over the place for people every day right now. And there's no reason that it won't work for you. No reason that it wouldn't happen for you. And I know some things have not happened or helped in the past. Didn't help. It didn't clear it. Didn't work. Maybe you've even had hypnosis that didn't work. Could have even been possibly hypnosis with me before I knew how to go in the direction to clear these things completely. I had to learn and dig and go and and move. And when I found this particular protocol that I'm working with right now, it was like dipping into that magical pot at the end of the rainbow and pulling out all the gold. Wow, this is incredible. And this is what I've been looking for. And I know that it's making a difference. People that have been doing it are having those success rates, clearing all the things. And I'm having those success rates now. And so that's why I'm going to talk about it even more in this particular series. Because the people that, that I'm talking to are dealing with people who are have so many different areas of symptoms that they're dealing with. Fibromyalgia chronic fatigue, long haul COVID. I know someone who's working specifically with people who are dealing with long haul COVID. I think I would love to do that. I haven't started that yet, but it's something that is in the back of my mind to go in and help those people to get back to some kind of functional state. And absolutely, I want to work with the military and the police and the first responders because that is my history and my family 
and that is where a big part of my heart is. But that doesn't mean that I don't want to work with the person who lives down the street who is in that hypervigilant state, who is having anxiety, who's delving into the panic attacks and not able to get out of them. I absolutely want to work with those people. I want to work with the people who can't get up and have wonderful adventure of public speaking because they can't manage to pull themselves in to the courage to do it. That's just as important to me, to get you where you want to be, to the success that you want to have in your life. So if you're hearing this and you want to know more, please go to the show notes, click in, set a time to have a conversation with me, and let's chat about it. Ask me, will what you do help me with this? And I will either tell you yes, no, I don't know, we can try, or I don't know, let me reach out and find out. I will find out. And pretty much 90% of the time, I get to say yes, I can help. Probably more than 90% of the time, I get to say absolutely I can help with that. Let's do it. Let's dive in. And this is something that I'm going to push more and more in my conversations with people. That's why I'm doing that secondary series, that that series on trauma and the symptoms behind it. Because once again, that's just a label. And labels are like bumper stickers. They're there. Slap them on, but then they're behind you. And then it's what you do going forward. It's not about that bumper sticker that's there. It's about what's inside, what's going on, what's happening. Where are you going? Where are you headed? Where do you want to head? And how do you want to feel as you get there? That, my friend, is what I want to dig into and to help you with. So there you go. I just wanted to put that out there and let you know that that's what's coming. That's what's going to be there. And if you are ready to have that conversation, I am ready to have it with you. If you're still listening and any of this has touched point with you, then I know it is time to have that conversation together. Go to the show notes or go to one of my many places you can find me at Laura Ordeal on Facebook, Laura Ordeal on Instagram, lauraordeal.com for my website, and you can book in a 20-minute free conversation with me, and we will find out what the best direction is to head for you personally. So there you go, and watch for that new series. Uh, I will let you know as soon as possible. I'm hoping... It would be in the next one to two weeks that you will see the first one of those come out. But as always, life is interesting, and so I don't want to guarantee it. But as soon as I get those edited and set up, I will let you know because they'll be popping out right after that. And the, and even if it's not for you, you might know someone that is dealing with something that can benefit from. So share it with them. And as always, I hope to meet you right here, same time next week. Have a great one. Ciao. I hope today's episode was interesting to you in some way and fun. If so, hey, find someone to share it with. Maybe they need to hear it too, or maybe they'll just enjoy it. If you'd like, go ahead and grab my tips on supercharging your success. It includes a free short meditation to do just that. You can find that at bit.ly slash supercharge your success. Until next time, 